Welcome back to the channel and welcome back to another quick pick prediction video. In this video, I'll be predicting the flyweight bout between Su Mataraji versus Zaruk Adashev. And this is a real quick prediction for me. Um, Su, Mataraji, uh, Su Mataraji is a taller fighter, the longer fighter. And I think he's the more technical striker. Yes, um, Adashev has competed in kickboxing and has done pretty well for himself. But he has one of those styles where it's like... Matter of fact, also, um, Mataraji is the better grappler. <clears throat> More goals post fighter, I think more technical than Adashev. Like yes, like I said, Adashev had competed in kickboxing, but his style is one of those styles that's it could be explosive, it could be technical, but it leaves a lot of I don't know if you heard that car in the background, but it is what it is. That big truck barreling in the background, but yeah. A lot of openings, you know, he likes those spinning stuff, he likes to throw big power, he likes to do flashy stuff. Whereas Sada Moderati, we saw in his fight against Malcolm Gordon, he was slick. He was Slipping just out of range, popping back in range, landing big shots, good jab, good straight, good shot selection, good timing, good eye, good reads. And not just um knowing like big spinning back kicks or spinning back fists or loading on big hooks or stuff. I know Adeshev has more stuff to his game, but against a guy like Matarati, who's just that clean and short and technical, I'm going to take him over a flashy spinning striker any day. Like they're going to waste all their time spinning around when you can just land, like just slip out of the way, let them spin, come back to position and pop them. I feel like it could happen a lot in this fight, but I really think it's going to be a case of Mataraji being cleaner, being technical, more technical, making those short slips, those short reads, and being able to land clean shots on Adashev, whereas Adashev looking for the bigger, flashier strikes, spinning back kicks, spinning head kicks, heel kicks, and stuff. And the cleaner, more technical, like textbook stuff is going to prevail over those. And also with the height, the reach, and the power on his side, and the grappling he needs to. I just feel like this fight is all Mataraji. I think he puts him way early on in the first one, not even needing to take this to the ground. Probably drop him, then finish him off on the ground. But So in this one, I got Sue Mataraji via first round TKO.